Yo, 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 man, what's going on, man? It's that boy Zeus the Entertainer back in front of this camera again, man, to give you guys another video. This song right here is one by that boy Ice Cube called Natural Born Killers. So let's get into it and listen to it. Let's go. <laughs> I'm tired as fuck. Come on, man. Let's get the fuck home. Oh, what's that real? I hate this neighborhood. They be tripping on me and shit. Come on, man. Hey! Hey, nigga! Oh, shit! Just keep walking. Don't turn around. Hey, I'm a fool! Here we go again. You ran, you motherfucking bitch. What's up? Hey, nigga, why you fucking with me? Dre coming out like that. Not Dr. Dre coming at you like that. Like, Dr. Dre was a nigga that was right at your neck. Like, yo, I wonder if Dr. Dre wrote his own music. Like, for real. Because, like, bro, I can't sit here and lie to y'all. Like, bro, the way Dr. Dre delivered his music and the shit he taught, bro, like, I, pro I probably said this in a video before with, with Dr. Dre, but I'm going to say it again. Like, you couldn't tell that nigga nothing, bro. He was the hardest nigga moving. Like, bro, there was not one nigga that was touching Dre, fucking with Dre, or doing nothing to Dre. Because Dre seemed like he was the type of nigga that was going bust first and ask questions later. He was going to do you dirty. And do whatever he wanted to do to you, step all over you and all of that, nigga. Dre put me in the mind like he the type of nigga. Y'all remember when motherfucking on Boys in the Hood when Doctor I said Doctor Dre when Ice Cube came up to that nigga and was like, turn your punk ass over. Like man, that's that's the shit that he put me on. Like for real, like bro, the way he just be delivering his music and the way he be talking, I be like, yo, hold up, nigga, calm down a little bit, bro. Like. Are you really like this, or are you just holding up an image? Like, I don't know about Dr. Dre. Like, bro, y'all gotta tell me, like, is Dr. Dre really like that? Or was Dr. Dre just, like I said, holding up an image? Like, because if he is holding up an image, man, he nailed that to the fucking, he nailed that to the ground. He nailed that to a T. Like, nigga, that nigga need an acting gig. Right now, at the age that he's at, bro, he need... His own TV show, bro. He need to star in that shit. Whatever, bro. Because he really held that shit to the T, bro. And he did that, like, for real, bro. And his name is Revolver It's like a deadly game of freeze tag I touch you with the booty for bag And you're frozen inside a body bag Nobody killer Then it's graveyard filler Cap filler Cause I'm a natural born killer Illustrates my era. Now I can't hang around my mama cause I scare her. I want the blast, motherfucker. Yeah, what's up? It feels like I'm busting a nut when I open your up. Hey, you know you a real ass nigga anytime your mama don't want you around, nigga. You you scaring your you scaring your own mom and she birthed you, nigga? And she don't want you around her, you know you causing some problems when you get stuck. Hey, bro, you causing some damn problems in these streets for niggas like, bro, anytime your own mom don't want you around, nigga, or she, you come over and she looking at you like this type shit, like, 
You know how you know that you know that look that moms give you that that concerned look, nigga. Like, bro. <laughs> hey dog. When I tell you, bro, that some your own mom is scared of you, bro, that's saying something, bro. That is saying something. Like for real, like. Cause like everybody like and, and here's my thing too. Every every parent their number one thing to say is, oh, he's a good kid. Oh, he's this and that. So you got to think when Tupac, I mean, not to why well, I keep saying the goddamn Tupac. When Ice Cube was putting out this goddamn music, I'm sure his own parents went and listened to that shit. And, bro, I know it had to set him back like, damn, my son really like this. Or, damn, my son really acting like this. Like, bro, I know as a parent, like, bro, it got to, you got to. Just blow your mind, cause not one, one second do you think your child is acting like this, or, you know, having that type of energy in them. But a lot of times we be having that energy in us, like just because we be one way around y'all, that's not how we be out in the streets, like for real, like. What y'all done? Like, yo, from everything with fucking Ice Cube, like, it's like, bro, you really felt that shit with him. Like, bro, that, that gangster rap sound and the way he delivered on every track, too. Like, bro, it was, it was, it, it's just different. Like, his voice really was what grabbed me, bro, what made me really like him. I like that energy. I like that aggressive and hard style that that nigga was you know portraying and putting out there as well like bro like ah uh, like man like damn like bro he really really was just the type of dude bro he just put me in the mind like you bro if i seen that man i'm gonna shake that man's hand and walk away like bro i don't want no problems with him i don't want to make him mad i don't want that man to have to do nothing to me like because that was just the way that you know, these gangster rappers made it seem like now it's like these rappers now that be doing this drill music, like these newer ones that be doing this drill music and this hard so called gangster rap, bro. I look at them niggas as just little Play Doh niggas. Like, y'all little niggas that just got out the sandbox one day and just said, I wanted to be tough or I wanted to be harder. Y'all got done with playing with what y'all action figures, y'all WWE action figures, and now all of a sudden y'all want to be gangsters and y'all want to pick up guns because y'all of age, bro. Y'all niggas are not like that. Y'all niggas are not like that. Y'all niggas are soft. Y'all niggas are lollipop ass niggas. Like these cats right here, bro. Just the way that they deliver, just the way that they talk, bro, would make me just sit back and be like, damn, bro, like, is this really a nigga that I want to make mad? Or is this really a nigga I want to go forth and mess with? Like, for real, it's just, it's the truth. Like, man. Nice cube on some murderous shit. Keep 
Keeping niggas in order, making their life shorter Ready to slaughter, cause to me a life Right with the quarter or a dime Mushrooms got my mind, hallucinating Ain't no debate, I'm creating an escape route To be out without a doubt Scott free, so don't even think about trying to stop me Cause I can't wait, I'm out the gate On the gorilla, a thriller from a natural born killer <laughs> That shit was hard. <laughs> like, for real. Hey, that shit was hard, bro. Like, bro, the way that they did they thing on that, man. Oh, my God, bro. That shit was hard, bro. Like, Dr. Dre really, like, he took that shit to a whole nother level. Like, oh, my God, bro. Oh, my God, bro. I, man. Man, oh, man, oh, man. <laughs> Oh my god, bro. That shit right there was definitely dope. I really like that shit, man. Hey, comment below how y'all felt about it, too. Make sure y'all leave a like on this video as well. Um, I got more work on the way for y'all, man. Like I said, I got a crazy schedule, crazy sleep schedule. So y'all don't, I don't know when y'all might see me on here again. So just be on the lookout for the next video that I'm gonna drop, man. Um, just from my first day even coming back to YouTube, bro. Getting back in front of this camera, doing some tracks, bro. I feel as though that this gotta be the first one that we drop. This gotta be the first one that we drop. So, hey, make sure y'all be on the lookout for it, man. It's y'all boys who's the entertainer, man. I'm up out of here. Peace out, baby. <laughs>